What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Sequence. This episode is brought to you by DraftKings. I'm your host, Trevor Plouffe, and today we have another very special guest, all-star reliever, three-time World Series champ. Maybe one of the only guys you can talk about in the big leagues who just needs to go by one name, Sergio. Sergio Rama, what's up, dude? Thanks for joining us. Oh, Pluffer. Thanks, man. Uh, here we go. You know, it's been quite the ride for me. <laughs> All right, let's get to the video. Before we do that, here's the ad read. The long wait is finally over. Golf's first major of the year is this weekend. The golfers are heading to San Francisco to tee off and compete for the crown. And there's no better way to join the action than with the DraftKings Sportsbook, America's top-rated sportsbook app. To celebrate golf's first major of the year, DraftKings Sportsbook is offering special odds and promotions all weekend long. And all new users get a sign-up bonus up to $1,000. Every day of the tournament, DraftKings Sportsbook is boosting your profits by 30%. All you have to do is opt in and place a bet. Head to the app right now and check out all that they have to offer, including player props, day-by-day -day action, and even hole-by-hole -hole live betting. As football season is clear in our sights, DraftKings Sportsbook has rolled out a season-long football pick em pool with $2 million in prizes up for grabs. Make your picks and watch the games unfold. Plus, DraftKings Sportsbook is a safe, secure, and reliable betting app. You can deposit and withdraw your funds at your convenience. Download the top-rated DraftKings Sportsbook app now and use code JOMBOY when you sign up. For a limited time, all new users can get a sign-up bonus up to $1,000. That's right. DraftKings Sportsbook is going all out with a sign-up bonus up to $1,000. Just enter code JOMBOY when you sign up. Only a DraftKings Sportsbook. Must be 21 or older, New Jersey only. Bonus compromise of a first deposit bonus and a first bet match, each up to $500. Deposit bonus requires 25 times playthrough. Restrictions apply. See DraftKings.com slash Sportsbook for details. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER. All right, let's start this video up here. Got it queued up. You just struck out Don Kelly. Here's the pitch. Slow mo. And that thing is going the opposite way of what he thought it was going to go. Yeah. His first at bat in him over a month. That was unfair. First at bat of the playoffs was that situation. That's tough. Especially facing yeah. you. So there he is. There's the big bad man. And I think this is about where I realized oh, no, not yet. I think, oh, that might have been the moment I realized oh, crap, it's him. And this you're nice and diced up. You're not. You don't got that shaggy look in this video. Uh, this is young look surge. At, look at that. Look. I was like, oh yeah, okay. Here we go. Nobody saw that I shook though. Right before that, I shook. Shook first pitch. Shook first pitch. I'm adventuring. I didn't. I don't think I said this, but this year you threw 515 sliders to 195 fastballs. Sick. It's a lot of sliders. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe said he's got your slider. And there he saw the first one. That's my normal one. That's the not my normal one, but that's the one I like to, you know, uh, get a strike if I'm trying to, you know, either get ahead or, uh, like I say, a guy hasn't faced me, you know, I a different look you know, at him. Yep. So, yeah. so now when you get 0-1, are you looking? I shook again. You shook again. And I said, I got to throw him my best strikeout one right here. So, so I, what does I that mean? Strike, I went to strike him out with one strike. <laughs> does that mean like you're starting third. it outer third like, and letting like, it run off? Like this is me. Like I'm throwing you my best challenge slider, and it's gonna look as yummy as possible, but it's nowhere gonna end where you think it's gonna end. Like you know what I'm saying? Like where it looks like it's like you if you haven't seen it before. You can't anticipate where it's going to end or where it can go or how big it could be or, you know, the movement of it, right? Sure. So at this point, I go, all right. So I threw him my get-ahead slider, basically. And after that, I go, I got to strike you out now. Because if, again, you haven't seen it before. If I can throw you one pitch, like my best one, my best bullet, right, and you swing and miss right <laughs> out the gates, you don't know what it looks like. I'm sorry. I can repeat that, and I can do that again. So, again, I went to strike him out All with right. one strike. All right. I go, okay, here's my best one. This is what, you know, and then I pulled it a little bit. Let's I think. see. I think I pulled it outside, but I shook again. I shook again. Yeah, you see where Posey's, he's actually set up off the plate right there. To punch his ticket, yes. Yeah. 
we understood each other. Like, that was just what we did. That was the way we we had attacked guys in that moment was I wasn't throwing. Yeah, I was throwing a lot of sliders, but I was I was just going for the punchy right out the yeah. gates. I was putting guys away with the first one, basically. So I shook again. You again. saw it there. I got to see that. So I shake uh. again. <laughs> and But Buster, every time I shook was putting down slider right back again so that's then look the i went to strike him out again so that's then i the give him right the good there, one dude. yes that's the one i was trying to all right boom and i go yeah and right here i go all right he's done i can do that again look at that oh <laughs> dude he's oh. not even close that miggy doesn't take those swings dude that's what i'm saying i go in that moment i go man i got you right here so i get on here and i shake again Give me the up. Oh, give it to me. Show it. Ah, oh, shook again. You shook again. And then Buster puts down slider again, and I go. I gotta punch his ticker right here. I gotta give the same thing. So I go in my head. I'm going same pitch, same pitch. Just punch his ticker right here, and then pulled. I it. pulled. It. <laughs> okay. It's just how big the moment is. Yeah, but I mean that's that's a good miss. If you say you know you miss, that's a good miss. Yes. So we get into the box again, and right here I go, give me a fastball. Give me a fastball. I go, this is my shot. This wow. is my shot to wait, throw wait, a fastball. Wait, wait, like, but why, though? Like, just the element of surprise, and this is okay, Miggy. So the second, the second, I, so he swings in the mid, he takes the first one, right, strike. Then I pull it. Then I throw him a good one. He swings and misses by a lot. Mm-hmm. Where did that last one start? Too far out. Uh, that, but but think about it. The one he swung at started middle or outer third, yes. and he missed by a lot, right? So he sees it out there. He swung and missed. If I start in the same spot, which is I basically did, but didn't, I pulled it a little bit more. He uh, the soon it was out of my hand, started away from him. He Take. gave up on it. So he has you zoned up now. That's how I always pitch. I pitch backwards in a sense. I look for my opportunities to throw my heater. So. That was my opportunity. I thought, dude, he just spit on one that started out there. That's what I look for. Those are things I look for. I read hitters. Like I, I, I look for little details, you know, and, and for me that helped me pitch, help me not necessarily guess, but maybe feel, you mm-hmm. know, it gives me a certain feeling that they may be looking for a certain thing or a certain location or, you know what I'm saying? Like, yep. I got to do that. Uh, uh, that's kind of why I feel that I tricked them also. I still was tricking them. <laughs> okay, okay. I mean, cool for we can go any which way about it. I'm still just tricking them. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, but dead on, like, I go, that's my chance to throw my heater. I go, so you wanted it heater. right away. You're like, Buster, right here, put two, the two, freaking the, one after down. After the four that I threw, I said, two, two. I go, this is my chance to throw a heater. Uh-huh. So, anyways, I shake. He gives me slider again. Shake. This time, yes. Shake. There it was. That's the Uh -uh. two shakes. Three shakes. Three shakes. So wait, did he go? (laughs) Did he go slider, slider? Boom, boom. boom, Right. So he puts down slider, and I say no. He puts down slider again. I say no. He puts down slider again. I throw a slider. And watch this. Watch this. It's a defensive swing. But he saw it. I, I, he saw it. It's defensive. Wow. But he saw it. He, he went to the spot on that one. I think he was looking fastball there. That's, you think so? Because he went, you did, you shook, because you shaken and shook then slider again, pitch. every single pitch. Shook. You shook twice there. He's like, fuck it. Maybe heater's coming. And that's why it was you defensive, think? right? You think? I don't know. I, I thought it was defensive because it was actually a good pitch. Like maybe he saw a heater, was like, yeah. "Oh crap!" And then and then it broke down. But then it goes, "Oh, they really did go there." But in my opinion, he saw it because look at okay. his base. He never lost his base. He wasn't again. out front on it. He wasn't behind it. He never lost his base. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So it was defensive only because his hand, his hands were the only defensive part. I go, damn, he saw it, and I go, oh, give me a heater, give me a heater. <laughs> and, and you my, shook right twice here, that time, right here, this whole time. I'm on the mound. I was like, give me a fastball, 
give me a fastball, give me a fastball. And I shook again. Let's see. Hopefully they show it. Uh-uh. Shake. Fastball. What? He gave me it. Hit the glove. Hit the glove. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Hit the glove. Hit the glove. Hit the glove. Oh, I'm throwing as hard as you can. Oh, boom. <laughs> oh, did we oh. win? Oh, we won. That was literally the moment. That's exactly how I thought in that moment because I got to go back and see it again. Think about it. So I shake. What? I shake like I'm getting shake. I'm getting chills right now like just thinking about what you're thinking about this moment. And then right here I'm literally going hit the glove, hit the glove, hit the glove, hit the glove. I lift There's my leg. Glove. I go, "Oh, right when I lifted my leg, it went from hit the glove to ah, oh, <laughs> like F it, like F it, throw it as hard as you can." Oh. And I think that's why it ran. That was a four-seamer that ran. Dude, that and pitch must have looked like a million miles an hour to Miggy right there. Right. Oh, anyways, guys, like, oh. like my dad, I talked to my dad, and he goes, I thought you were going to throw a fastball to pitch before. And I go, Dad, I thought the same <laughs> thing. <laughs> I love it, but man. Maybe he – but, again, I never – I never. I guess I didn't see it from a hitter's perspective either, in which you are a hitter. You're like, like you don't just go up there and bat. Like you hit. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I, 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 hey, I faced you. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, so from a hitter standpoint, oh no, Miggy regrets maybe telling you he's ready for your slider. <laughs> but that's the thing. Like, dang, he recognized me. He acknowledges my existence first off, which boosted my confidence through the roof. <laughs> Come on, man! I was one of the best invisible players in all of baseball until that moment with him straight up straight I mean, up i didn't mind being invisible i actually enjoyed being one of the best invisible players in baseball <laughs> that was i've watched the at bat okay like i've seen it i saw it live i've gone over it prepping for this show and listening to you talk about it and then kind of reliving it with you is freaking awesome man like yeah oh man it, dude, i rarely it, get chills like that that gave me chills just thinking about you in that situation being like buster give me the heater give me the heater give me the heater yes and i'm just like give me a fastball get like and i this thing is i was feeling this man and again when i sit there and i say i, I feel that i have certain traits or certain qualities about me that allow me to compete i think my feel for the moments my my feel for the game in the situation that I'm in, I think that's one of the things that major things that allows me to compete. And in that moment, I was purely in the moment, just engulfed with how I felt was happening, what was forming, you know, coming to fruition in my face, you know, and, 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 and I, I literally was like, come on, give me a fastball, give me a fastball, give me a fastball. And he, he gave it to me like, holy crap. Like, <laughs> It was slider and shook, and he went straight to it that time. He didn't make me shake again to it or, you know. Mm -hmm. And that was actually the first time he had given me a fastball on that whole sequence. So uh, and I'm, in that moment, I do really believe that Buster and I were the only ones on the planet that knew I was throwing a fastball in that moment. That's crazy. I really, really believe that because – I mean, come on, man. Like you said, I was seventy oh. something percent sliders that year. Incredible. Like, they're gonna sh they're gonna show one more slow mo of it right here. Three out of four. Then I'll let you go. I didn't mean to throw it down the middle. I will admit <laughs> that I did not mean to throw it down the middle. That was a four seamer that ran like a two seamer. I meant to hit the out like outer third at least. I'll give me that. I'll give myself that. I meant to at least throw a strike outer third, but down the middle, no shot. No shot. Not to that guy. <laughs> Dude, you're incredible. I appreciate you coming <laughs> on, sharing the insight. This is a moment that I'm sure a lot of people still remember um, and they think about it a lot because it's, it meant a lot to the organization, obviously, winning the World Series. Um, but just hearing your insight about it is incredible. So okay. um, everybody go follow Sergio on IG, Sergio Romo 54 and I know you're doing some stuff uh, gaming. So you have a Twitch handle you want to Yeah, the same. Plug? it's the same thing. It's uh, – Sergio Romo, uh, five four at uh, you know at the Twitch uh, dot TV, you know. So. Cool man, we'll we'll link it all, and um, I know people are gonna love this, dude. So I appreciate <laughs> you coming on again, and and good luck. Uh, season starts tomorrow for you guys. Um, can't yeah. wait to watch you, bro. Former teammate, good friend. Thank you, Mr. Trevor Plouffe. You're amazing.